my honey bees, it's your girl Henny, and today I'm gonna be eating nuclear fire noodles with eggs. So let's dig in, cause I'm so hungry. So this is one of my other favorite combinations, nuclear fire noodles and eggs. A lot of you guys ask me, oh, the fire noodles is too spicy for me. How can I eat it? You can either eat it with some cheese, and if you guys don't like cheese, you can try it with some eggs. It kind of makes the spice a little bit easier to handle. Cheers. Mmm. I don't want to crack my yolk. Mmm. Oh yeah. To have a normal bite too on this little cute dish. Mmm, pickled radish. I want to give a huge shout out to Archival Crossings on Instagram. He made this cute honey from Animal Crossing. It's a little more juicier today, the noodles. Usually when you guys see me eat noodles, they're all dried up because it takes time for me to set up, to take the thumbnail. But today, it is nice and hot and juicy. Yum. Let's have it with this whole egg. Mmm. Oh yeah. Mm mm. 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 I think the egg definitely helps with the spice. So, did you guys know that there's this certain type of apple juice where if you bite into the bottle, it sounds like you're biting into a real apple so I had to show my brother B so that I could see his reaction and it was the cutest reaction ever. So apparently, if you bite into this apple juice, it sounds like you're biting into an apple. Do you believe that? No. <laughs> okay, let's first bite into your apple. Mm -hmm. Like so they can hear the sound. Okay, let me, this is an apple juice, right? Let me drink out of it to show you. Are you ready for the magic? Mm -hmm. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> You're not doing it, right? No. <laughs> If you guys find it at a Target or a CVS near you, you guys should definitely try it. It's so cool. Mm. For those of you guys who like the yolk drip, 
Let's get one for you guys. Dun. So, I did something crazy today. Can you guys guess what it is? A lot of people have been doing this during quarantine. And I can't believe my brother B let me do this. Comment down below if you guys know what this crazy thing is that I did. A lot of people would have not let me touch their hair like that. But my brother was like, you know, I trust you. You can cut my hair because his hair was getting long. Mm-hmm. I opened... A honey hair salon. <laughs> you are the first customer. I really like the way it turned out. I think my brother B did. I don't know if he was just trying to be nice, but he says he likes it. It was really fun. Let me know in the comments down below how you guys think I did. Did I do a good job? Did I do a terrible job? And please hit that like button if you guys think I did a good job. It's my first time cutting anyone's hair. And I'm thankful that my brother be let me cut his hair and trusted me and believed in me. His hair was like this. Covering one of his eyes. If you guys need a haircut, you guys can come visit Honey's Hair Salon if you guys think I did a pretty good job. I will trim your hair for you. I feel like I've been talking a lot, a little bit too much in my videos. So I am talking a little less. And we are almost at the end of this video. Let's take two separate bites. That egg yolk pop. Let's see. Boop, pop. Cut it in half. Ta-da! And now... This is going to be my last bite. Let's get that egg in there. Da -da.
Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And to become a honeybee, and like this video if you guys liked it. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!